Now we're going to go over how to set up a meeting and how to join a meeting in Zoom. So the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and open up Zoom. Once that opens up, we're going to go ahead and click uh, New Meeting. Once you do that, you can see it's connecting here. Um, and you can, you have a bunch of different options down here, but what first is going to pop up is join with computer audio um, and that's what you're going to want to go ahead and click <clears throat> and you can also click here to automatically join by the audio if you the computer audio when joining that way this doesn't keep popping up so we'll just go ahead and do that um, so down here you can see the microphone you can mute the microphone or unmute it and up here you get a bunch of different settings here I'm using an external microphone right now so that's why you see the headset one um, you can use the same as system that's what it'll default to if you don't have something plugged in and same with video if you go ahead and click here make sure you have um, the correct uh, video kinda set um, so it uses your webcam or maybe you have an external webcam you can go ahead and use that um, but down here, you can see you get all your different options, and here's the invite button. And if you go ahead and click on that, you can do contacts, um, or you can copy the URL, or copy the invitation, however you want to do it. So if you just um, go ahead and click copy, the whole email has been um, copied, so we can just go ahead and go into a different email client and email it that way or up here at the top if you just click on email you can go ahead and click on Gmail or whatever uh, service you use that pops up there and it's gonna go ahead and open up Gmail for me and it's using the same Gmail account that I'm already logged into in Zoom because that's my main account for Zoom is just my Gmail account Once it loads, you'll see it pops up with the email, um, and it, here's the information, right? So here's the web link they can click on. There's the meeting ID and password, which you can use to join a meeting. And then up here, you'll just go ahead and type in the email address of the people you want to send it to. And I'll just show you if I just paste, because we said copy the invitation. It's the same exact information as it would be if you click to the email one. So you can go ahead and kind of do it any way you want there. Just go ahead and close that. So that's how you can invite people. It's pretty easy. Um, it's probably better to copy the whole invitation. That way they don't only just get the URL, but they also get the um, meeting password and everything like that so that they can go ahead and join the meeting. Um, and then you get a bunch of different options down here but we'll go over those later. Um, we're gonna go ahead and click end meeting for now. And this, you get some options. You can end the meeting for all. So um, if you're the one who created the meeting and everything, if you hit end meeting for all, everyone will be kicked out of the meeting. Um, but if you just hit leave meeting, it'll, it'll still run until everybody leaves. So just go ahead and click end meeting for all. So to go ahead and join a meeting in Zoom, if someone's emailed you um, the invitation, that's great. That's the easiest way to go ahead and do it. And that's what we're going to show here because that's how most people do it. Um, you can see this is the email they have sent me. There's a link to the Zoom meeting and there's the meeting ID and the meeting password. If you open up Zoom and click join meeting, you would need the meeting ID and the meeting password in order to um, join the meeting, you type those in, you'd automatically join the meeting. But if I just want to uh, join it pretty quick, I can just click the link. It's going to load up a web page and then it's going to launch Zoom. See, it's going to ask us, do we want to open Zoom? Click open. And it's going to automatically um, connect. And you can join with video or join without. It's up to you. There we go. 
So you can see we've now joined. Um, we've now joined the meeting here. And we can do all the typical things you would down here. And we can also leave the meeting, which I'm going to go ahead and do. So that's the easiest way if they've gone ahead and emailed you that link. That's the easiest way to go ahead and join the meeting. But again, if you just have that password and everything, you can click join here. And we'll go back and get, move this out of the way. We'll just copy this and we'll paste in the meeting ID. Click join. Then it's going to ask for the meeting password and we'll go ahead and type that in. And we'll click join meeting. And here you go, you get the same screen, join with video. Boom, there you go. So if for some reason you can't um, join just by clicking the link, you can go ahead and join by putting in the meeting password <clears throat> and everything. So the meeting ID and the password. So that's how you go ahead and join a Zoom call. Hopefully that helps.